sorry my car is in the shop so I'm shooting from my bedroom today. Uh, it's nothing to look at, I'm very sorry. Not the best of locale, but today we are going over what I found at PetSmart for Halloween. And I'm super excited. Usually I'm very disappointed in the cat toys. The dog toys are always plentiful, but the cat toys, they kind of phone it in. Not only is the selection much smaller, but even the designs are kind of meh. So <laughs> I wasn't going to go to PetSmart this year and do anything with it. I, I debated, but I did end up going in and I was pleasantly surprised. They are killing it with the cat toys this year. I'm so excited. Um, a couple of mentions on the dog toys and the fish uh, accessories. I usually uh, would go over those, but I was I was too distracted by the cat toys, so I didn't even get to film any. But this year they have glow in the dark skulls and bones for the dogs, which is you know me. I'm I'm obsessed with anything glow in the dark, so <laughs> super excited. I myself don't have a dog right now. Uh, my parents have a dog, and my in-laws have dogs. So uh, I I do love dogs, and I would love to have a dog. I don't have the energy for a dog and I don't feel like it would be fair to the dog. So uh, I might eventually, when we get settled into our new house, get a dog. Uh, Joseph wants a German Shepherd, which I'm all for. I had one when I was a kid and I loved it. So <laughs> I can't understand people who are, oh, I'm a dog person, I hate cats, or I'm a cat person, I hate dogs. I love them all. Any animal you have, snakes, lizards, tarantulas, I don't care. I love them. Rats, I love them. Um, except the males kind of creep me out because I know they drag their, yeah, all over and leave a trail. Anyway, <laughs> I do, I do love all animals. So uh, the fish uh, last year, I didn't look at the tanks this year, but last year they had some monster or alien shaped tanks. And of course they have that headless horseman with the floating jack-o'-lantern head that makes me want to get fish. <laughs> I'm afraid I would forget to feed them. Um, I don't know, maybe one day, <laughs> but I, I love that Headless Horseman. They also have a jack-o'-lantern and they have a clam with a, vi a vampire teeth, which was <laughs> odd, but cute. <laughs> okay, so on to the cat toys. Okay, first you see this guy here. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. We're excited together. Okay, <laughs> this is a cat bed. I showed you a Day of the Dead uh, cat bed I saw in an earlier video, which was white with a sugar skull, which was very pretty, but I could not refuse this guy. Look at him. <laughs> Little orange and black legs, the look on his face, and look, the dangler is a little fly. <laughs> I couldn't resist. My cat is so spoiled. I will buy her all this stuff and she doesn't want to play with it. She doesn't sleep in any of the beds that I buy her. But <sighs> I spent over $100 on my cat. I'm sorry. I make, I make very poor life decisions, but <laughs> I couldn't resist him. Look at him. I'm also very sorry that you're bouncing around. Uh, you are clipped to the cat perch and uh, she's moving around over there. So you're a little bouncy. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> I did buy quite a bit. So. Um, okay, so next is my favorite, favorite, absolute favorite. <laughs> okay, so it's a pack of five toys and I got two sets because I just, I couldn't. Uh, <laughs> okay. Look, it's an eyeball with bat wings. <laughs> a little jack-o'-lantern with a witch hat. A little bottle of Eye of Newt. And then just two shiny balls they threw in there to fill out the pack. But I got two packs of these because I love this eyeball. I want that floating around my house so bad. <laughs> I might actually go and get more because... That is the coolest thing I've ever seen. I mean, I could make my own, but I mean, 
it's so cute. <laughs> so I got two of those. <laughs> they also have uh, those little ball chasers with the feathers. You got another eyeball with feathers. And then they have quite a few things with these little constellations, stars, uh, very witchy vibe. Um, in the video, you'll see a little laser pointer has that, and I'll show you the play tube that has that. I'm getting up on it. Um, <laughs> so I'm redecorating my basement to be my craft room, and I'm doing it in Halloween color theme, so that way I don't have to pack away my Halloween decorations, and hopefully they can give me a little inspiration as I work. But the colors are black with purple, orange, and green, so I was super excited. <laughs> super excited to find this little ghost. <laughs> and he has purple, orange, and green little streamers. Or armpit stank. I don't I don't know. <laughs> but he looks like um oh what's the Pokemon? The the blue one. What Wubbuffat? Is that his name? Look at his face. He looks like him. I couldn't resist. <laughs> so cute, so cute. And then um, the the dangly wands. I don't know if that's what you call them. <laughs> dangly bits. <laughs> so uh, usually I'm not happy with what they have on them, but this one was so cute. It's an orange wand with a little pumpkin, little green stem. You have little black and orange pom poms on some sparkly bits purple and black ribbons that are all crunchy and they have little green ribbons and purple feathers. Uh, I love it. <laughs> then I got another wand which, um, let me try to get a little closer here. Okay, they threw in a normal like purple mouse. It's kind of iridescent-y, so it's pretty. It's pretty. And they have black and orange pom-poms attached to that. But what I got it for <laughs> is the other attachment. <laughs> I can get it to turn around. <laughs> it's a bat. It's a little bat with little dangly pom-poms and feathers. Look at him. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm, I'm a geek. I'm sorry I'm such a geek. I, I'm happier with the cat toys than the cat. Okay. <laughs> All right, and then the last thing I bought is one of those little crinkled tunnels. It collapses. So when company comes, you can uh, store it away. It has a little purple sparkly pom-pom, but like I said, killing it with the witchy vibes and Halloween this year. Look at the pattern. They have mauves. They have crystals, gems, moons, stars. They have the little eyeball, and there it is. And they have the little hand with the eye in it. Oh, I couldn't resist. She never plays with any of this stuff, but I can never resist. <laughs> so my cat is uh, Puka, and she's about 10 years old, even though she still looks like a kitten because she's very petite. She's always been very small-faced. <laughs> I don't know if that makes any sense, but she's naturally young looking. <laughs> um, I am planning on getting another cat uh, once I'm ready. I just had one pass. Um, so uh, hopefully <laughs> the new cat will play with the toys and uh, hopefully once we get in the other house, maybe, maybe Puka will play with the toys. But she is spoiled rotten, as you can tell. <laughs> <laughs> when she was uh, a kitten, uh, we found her abandoned and she was very sick. She was very small. I'm surprised she was eating solid food. She looked way too young to get solid food down her. So <laughs> something we had to do to get her to eat because she wasn't really eating much. And I gave her a tuna and she would eat the tuna, but you can't survive a cat on tuna, especially with the mercury levels. So in order to get her to eat, her actual cat food, we would have to pet her, which is essentially when they're that small, just petting her whole body, which ended up being her butt. <laughs> 
So you have to pet her butt <laughs> to get her to eat because we would scratch her butt and give her little affirmations. My little fuzzy butt, you're so cute. And now in order to eat, she demands that you scratch her butt. So <laughs> I mean, she will eat if we're not here, but if we're here, she will sit there and stare at us until we acknowledge her. If we continue to ignore her, she'll start meowing and she'll just give us a look like, you're so mean, you want me to starve? How can you expect me to eat if you're not scratching my butt? So... <laughs> What? Go eat. Oh, did I stop petting? <laughs> I know, it's weird, but she's so spoiled. <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> um, again, thank you for watching, and I hope you found something that you like in these videos. Again, I, I love the bat eyeball. I love it. It's, it's the best. That's that in the spider bed. <laughs> I I burst out laughing when I found this. Like the, the associate came over and was like, um, can I help you? And I'm like, no, no, just filming your crap and laughing at the bed.
again thank you for clicking on my video i really appreciate it happy halloween keep searching i'm still searching all the stores <laughs> in my area they don't get things out very fast and when they finally do get them out they're already packing them up so every little find is just a gem so <laughs> happy halloween again thanks for clicking Oh my god, you'll actually play with that one. Ooga. Okay.